traveled down to Florida because he liked to fish. Had his daddy's money to do with as he wished. He bought four million acres in 1881. Paid a quarter on a dollar. He knew how a deal was done. He helped Flagler finish building rails along the coast. Trigger in a land boom for the governor to promote. Said he could drain the Everglades for half the land he saved. Turn what's left to farmland for the people and the state. Hamilton Distant had a vision of the changes he could make. On a mission of acquisition from Sanford to Orlando, down to Simi Way, he took what was and made what is the state we're in today. Built a town or two of which we can be proud. Tarpon Springs and Gulfport, Kissimmee and St. Cloud, and on the shores of Toe, he planted sugar cane. Many a street in Florida today still bears his name. Came an economic bust in 1893, left the state in disrepair and no economy. His sugar cane plantation was destroyed by an early frost. All his plans and promises now seem forever lost. Hamilton Distant had a vision of the changes he could make. On a mission of acquisition from Sanford to Orlando, down to Simi Way, he took what was and made what is the state we're in today. He went to see a play, dinner with the mayor, and then what happened, who can say? It all depends on what you heard or what it is you read. He either died of a heart attack or put a bullet through his head. Hamilton Distant had a vision of the changes he could make. Acquisition from Sanford to Orlando, down to Simi Way. He took what was and made what is the state we're in today. Yeah, he took what was and made what is the state we're in today.